What's up, everybody? Anthony here, Empire Music, EmpireMusic.com, 412 343 5299. Filling in for Joe again for old this week. Great new stuff to show you. So, as I mentioned last week, we really focused on that Taylor American Dream deal that is like so crazy cheap for some of those guitars. Uh, that's still going on. So, whatever's left on the website at this point is still available. Reach out. Uh, you can email any one of us. It's just our first names at empiremusic.com. So mine would be Anthony at empiremusic.com. Joe, Justin, Jordan, any of the guys can help you out. Uh, American Dream stuff, like that stuff's like $100 over cost in some cases because we're just kind of covering the shipping and whatever processing uh, fees would go on. Uh, so there's a link in the description. Take you to all of our Taylor American Dream inventory. If you're watching this on Instagram, you can link right uh, in our bio. There's a Linktree account that'll get you to the website, to all the sale pages. It'll get you to all of our social media. Uh, and if you're watching this on YouTube, please subscribe to the channel. I greatly appreciate that. It's a very easy and free way to support what we do here at Empire Music that doesn't really take any monetary uh, donation, we'll call it, uh, even though you'd be getting something, but you don't have to buy anything essentially from us to, and, and still support what we do here at Empire Music. Greatly appreciate it. Uh, anniversary sale is on. It's going strong. Links in all the places I just mentioned as well. Uh, so 22 years Empire Music has been here. Uh, I've been here for now about seven or eight of those years. God, it's, I always forget how long it's been. And I shopped here almost from the get-go, whenever they opened up, whenever Joe opened the shop up. And uh, so 22 years here, we're offering 22% off select inventory. It's not a ton of stuff. It's really focusing on some custom shop models. But if you're interested in any of our Empire exclusive stuff as well, uh, great time to do that. So again, just call the shop, 412-343-5299. We'll get you great pricing on our exclusive stuff. That's with Taylor, that's with Martin, that's with Fender Custom Shop, that's with Fender even. Uh, we'll discount that stuff pretty nice just to kind of celebrate what we do here at Empire Music. So links everywhere in the description and the link in the bio, all that good stuff. Uh, check it out, great ways to save some money. Showing you used and if you have used and you want to trade in, reach out, call the shop, email us. If you do email, please include some pictures right away. It would really, really help us. And if you have the serial number that you could present in one of those pictures, it would also help us out just to kind of know what we're looking at. Uh, but we'll give you some great pricing on your trade and we'll also send you a label to pick that up. So save you some money in that case too. And get you a great deal on the outgoing gear too. So 1961 Gibson Hummingbird. I love these guitars. I just love Gibson acoustics. I mean, as, as a bassist, you know, acoustic is almost kind of like third on my list as far as, I mean, my knowledge is always getting better. I always ask Joe a million questions when it comes to acoustic guitars. But I, I know what I like the sound of, and I'm almost like that with any instrument, even if I can play it poorly. I at least know when I hear something that sounds good. I think these sound amazing. Fixed bridge thermally aged, so uh, roasted Sitka spruce top, mahogany back and sides. What's interesting is when we get on the dread shape here is when we get to that shorter scale length, uh, I think I believe it's 24.75, uh, so 24 and three quarters. Uh, I always relate it back to bass, how, like how short scale basses have their particular thing. They warm up in different areas because you have the lower tension on the strings. You really get that out of the dread. I think it's interesting when you get to these big body guitars with shorter scale length because you kind of have these two sort of opposite things as far as like um, a big instrument, but like shorter playability. But the sonic things that happen with that, I think are very cool. So I always love the sound of these when I've had a chance to hear them and to play them. Uh, so that's in now. Love these guitars. Fender Custom Shop American Custom. Uh, comp. So American Customs, I kind of think of it as like a custom shop version of, not necessarily like an ultra, because they do a closer version of that. Um, it's almost kind of like postmodern-y kind of thing that, that they get. So I guess that's like a, another custom shop model. Um, but you have Texas Special in the neck. 69s in the middle and bridge position. So you have a cool complement of pickups in it. Beautiful 3A bird's eye maple. That's a stunning neck on that. One piece there. And then a rosewood fretboard on it. 
compound radius. So I believe it is nine and a half to 12. Uh, the modern tuners with the perloid ends on it, I, it's, I think those are Spurzels, 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 is that how you say it? Spurzel tuners. <laughs> um, but it's a, like a cool blend of nice custom shop features that you get in one package. So that just popped through. We don't get too many of these, and every time we get them, they sell. So I wouldn't be surprised if by the time you click on that little link in the email, and if you don't get our email, shame on you. Please subscribe to our email list. There's links to that everywhere, too. Uh, Eastman SB59. So basically their version of, like, it's much much less expensive, of a 59 Les Paul or, like, a, like a standard 50s or a custom shop Les Paul. Uh, Duncan 59's in it. Um, he's got some weight to it, so it certainly feels like a Les Paul. Uh, but cool to see an Eastman pop through. This is like 1300 bucks, 1250 on that. I wouldn't be surprised if that kind of flies out the door. Slick little guitar there. Uh, Taylor 314 Special Edition, uh, Sunburst Top, and then Sapele back and sides. Layered Sapele, but oh no, three, three series, USA made, solid Sapele. Sapele is a great tone wood, kind of sits right in the middle of everything. Sapele is like the. I think of it as sometimes when I talk about Palfaro fretboards, how they kind of split the difference between a lot of different woods. I think Sapele does that well. Very sleek looking guitar with the um, ebony head cap and the black tuners on. That's a great, great look on that. So that's a cool guitar. And that price was great too, if I recall correctly. $17.99. Uh, hard to compete right now with the American Dream Series sales we got going on. But if you're looking for really the original first tier of American-made tailors, great, great way to get into that. You know, because American Dreams kind of took that place. But for, you know, I remember my first four or five years here was always, if we were talking starting into American-made tailor stuff, it was a three series, right? That was like the entry point into like the solid wood American-made stuff. Now with American Dream going away, that's back to being like your first tier um, of American made Taylor. So it's cool. American vintage two, uh, 61 strat. So pure vintage 61 pickups in there, seven and a quarter radius Rosewood board. Uh, what is that neck profile? It's a 61 oval C. So pretty similar to what we feel on like the sixties oval C in the custom shop. Um, I always will say that, and I guess it, it, I, feel like a broken record when I say it, but American Vintage 2, whether we're talking basses or guitars, is a great way to get into the vintage, um, you know, tone, the, the vintage aesthetic on a guitar. And um, without jumping all the way into custom shop pricing, and now that we have it used, 15, is that right? That is right. $15.99, someone should buy this guitar. <laughs> it's a great price on that. Um, if Again, if any of this stuff, we're going... Joe's been aggressive on his pricing. Joe and Jordan together on there. I love it. Uh, get him in. Let's get him out of here. Um, now, the opposite of the American Vintage 2 would be the American Ultra. Noiseless pickups in there. Compound radius. Deep contoured neck heel in it. This is in such a cool finish. Great lighting in here for the finish. I'm sure Brent's going to kill it with that. Uh, you got, it's Texas T. In certain lights, it looks black. Not, in, well, it's not with this. In this light, you really got the gold. He's giving me the thumbs up that he got it. Almost kind of like mustardy in a few, like when the light catches it. That is, that's super slick with the gold anodized guard. I like these instruments here. People think those noiseless pickups are brash and a little bit too modern. Um, Fender did a really good job with this generation of voicing them uh, to have a little bit of vintage kind of tone aesthetic to it. And then, a little throwback here, American Pro 1. So the first iteration of it, uh, you have the deep, I think they call that fret, that neck profile, it was a deep modern C, nine and a half race, this thing's super light, classic butterscotch blonde, V-Mod 1 pickups in there. So they were a little brighter than what we got with the V-Mod 2s. I think everyone was requesting them to go kind of back to a more vintage voicing. I think that's what everyone was after there. Um, but these still, this, this, these were great pickups. A um, little hot, slightly hotter output to it, but I actually think they're a little bit more versatile than what you got out of the V-Mod 2s. Love both of them, though. And then lastly, little Charvel guy looking for the Floyd Rose thing. Some heavy, some, some weight to it with the locking. Duncan pickups in there. Uh, Pro Mod HSS. 
So I think that's an ebony, it looks like an ebony board. Like great rounded frets on that too. This is like $8.99. Cool little shredder guitar. So old this week, some great new stuff. Remember, anniversary sale going on, going strong. 22% off select inventory, very select inventory. That's a deep, deep discount on some stuff. There's Fender Custom Shop in there. Some really nice stuff. American Dream Sale. That's the craziest stuff we've been doing with Taylor in a long time. Almost near cost on that stuff. If you have a trade, reach out. 412-343-5299. See you next week.